Students and staff at UW-Madison are getting a taste of the future. Autonomous delivery robots are cruising along sidewalks, taking food to wherever it's wanted. Francisco Almanar has you covered on the start of this new pilot program. Hello, here's your delivery. Robots are taking over UW-Madison's campus, filled with food for students and staff. Thank you. Have a nice day. People on campus pick from one of three campus dining options to order their meal. Someone then puts the food inside the robot and off it goes. Now UW-Madison hasn't had a food delivery service for years, so these robots won't be taking any jobs away from students. In fact, they plan on actually creating some. They'll be uh, keeping track of the delivery iPad and uh, getting the orders from the different venues and putting them in the robots and sending them off to their final location. Starship Technologies provided UW the robots for free and operating costs are paid for by a $2 delivery fee. The university says even when it snows, they'll use onboard cameras and pre-programmed maps to get around. So, there'll be times over the winter where they're not able to run, um, but the robots were built in Estonia. So they were built, built in a dark, cold, snowy climate, so they're very accustomed to that. UW-Madison is the fourth and largest campus the robots are undergoing testing. There have been reports from some other campuses that the robots have made it hard for people in wheelchairs to get around them. Starship has already taken actions internally to uh, help make sure that that doesn't happen again. Uh, parking further back from the sidewalk ramps off to the side so that those individuals can safely maneuver around those robots. UW-Madison says they'll see how this pilot program goes, but is optimistic these robots will be here to stay. In Madison, Francisco Almanara, 27 News. The pilot program runs until the end of the school year with 30 robots on campus for now. If the pilot program goes well, they may get more later.